Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 61. REM sleep. How often does REM sleep occur? REM sleep occurs every 90 minutes, and the duration of REM sleep increases throughout the night. What is the principal neurotransmitter in REM sleep? The principal neurotransmitter in REM sleep is acetylcholine. What neurotransmitter can reduce REM sleep? Norepinephrine can reduce REM sleep. What are all the findings observed in REM sleep? All the findings of REM sleep includes increased and variable pulse and blood pressure. Also, you have extraocular movement during REM sleep due to activity of PPRF, which is the paramedian pontine reticular formation, also known as the conjugate gaze center. And also, you have penile or clitoral tumescence, and tumescence just means that it's excited or erected. What is the mnemonic to help you remember some of the findings of REM sleep? The mnemonic to help you remember this is just remember, REM sleep is like sex. In sex, you also have increased pulse, just like in REM sleep, you also have increased pulse. There is penile and clitoral tumescence, so that means penis or the clitoris is excited, and there's decrease in frequency with age. So all these things happen in sex as well as in REM sleep. What are some of the terms given to REM sleep? Because the REM sleep has the same EEG pattern as wakefulness. Because REM sleep has the same EEG pattern as wakefulness, it has been termed paradoxical sleep or desynchronized sleep. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first date for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.